Well, hello, and thanks for clicking on this video today. Today, we're going to be traveling to Gaffney, South Carolina, and we're going to the outlets, and we're going to the Crate and Barrel Outlet store to see what they have in there and what deals we may be able to find. Let's go on and go in. So the first thing that you're going to notice when you go in is this is not set up like any other crate and barrel store that you go in because it's an outlet. And so um, because of that, you know, things are just kind of going to be arranged in very unusual ways, chairs on top of tables, that type of thing. Um, but they are very nice quality, that quality that we know that crate and barrel has. You just have to be willing to look through. But you see here their sale guide and you see that you will get deals on the items if you um, were to make a purchase in this location. Now, delivery, I'm not sure how that works here. It's probably um, take it with you as you go. Um, there's no bells or whistles here. Um, you just kind of look through and see. You really kind of have to see what you like as opposed to coming here looking for a particular item because that's like looking for a needle in a haystack. You, you get what you get and you don't pitch a fit, as they say at my granddaughter's school. These chairs are gorgeous love them now they would be 40 percent off of that price that's shown so that is a pretty decent price for uh item from crate and barrel If you're not familiar, Crate and Barrel has very high quality contemporary and modern furniture. And then they have their CB2, which continues to have that really high quality, but at a more affordable price. But you're still able to find really, really nice modern and contemporary pieces at a more affordable price. And then you have the Crate and Barrel outlet where it is going to be the most affordable of them all. But there are pieces that are probably probably from prior seasons. And I've noticed that in some of the pieces, I see some imperfections, some little dents and things like that in them. So maybe they were delivered to someone's home and were damaged in delivery or something like that. And so they landed into this outlet store. But you can still get some beautiful pieces here. Um, you know, at a reduced price. Now, that doesn't mean they're inexpensive because they're not, but they're more affordable than that typical crate and barrel price. Everything in the store is at least 40% off of the prices that are shown. I'm in the market for a rug for my living room, but I don't have the patience to go through and look for them here. And then they had um, linen curtains and things like that here um, to select from. Again, you got to go kind of search through them, but I'm sure you can find some really nice quality items and everything is on sale. My mother always says you can tell good quality furniture the way that the drawers pull out and glide in. And let me tell you, these drawers glide. <laughs> Now, these items are not in my price range, but I do respect the fact that when you buy high quality furniture, you are getting a lot more for your money. You get pieces that will hold up. Case in point, the last few pieces of furniture that I purchased, I purchased them from places like Home Goods, Wayfair, even Overstock. And let me tell you, the quality, it ain't the same. I got a cheaper price. It was affordable, but it ain't the same. I am in love with this uh, natural stones. This is uh, 
tra- travertine or travertine. Not sure how to pronounce it, but I love that stone. I think it is so nice. This little uh, cloche here was cute. And then they had these little random marble bowls and things like that. So some of these decor pieces were pretty good prices on them because again, they were at least 40%, some were 50% off. Now, I know this is an outlet, but it seems that they would do a little bit of decorating in here. Wouldn't it be nice to have some nice pillows and something on that table? But anywho, it's a discounted price. I guess they say they are doing the bare minimal. I really like this little knot here. This is made of that Triratine, um natural stone. Again, this was $200, but she said it was 50% off. So $100, still expensive. I saw a very similar one at World Market at a fraction of the cost. Mm -hmm. I like this piece a lot. This would be nice for a small buffet or even a bar. It's got the marble top on here. It's a nice quality piece here. And this was 50% off of the shown price. And it's got all of these little compartments on the inside. I really like this little piece. It's more of the uh, mid-century modern style, but I love it. If you're looking for high-end uh, furniture, I would definitely recommend stopping in to a place like this to take a look around on the day that I was here. They did have quite a nice selection of items. Um, I didn't really see anything that needed to come home with me, but definitely if in the market for particular uh, furniture pieces, this is a great place to come and look for some nice quality pieces. Of course, this table caught my attention because it's got the marble top and then the bottom of it kind of looks like it might be that Trivertine stone again, but this was a nice piece of furniture here. Very, very heavy duty as well. All right, we're going to go ahead and leave this store and we're going to go over to the Pottery Barn outlet. Now, we were here just a couple weeks ago, so I just thought I'd stop in just because I'm here just to see what they might have in. And I see that they have a lot of items out here for spring and Easter. So if you're in the area of Gaffney, South Carolina, and you're in the market for some spring items, they had an abundance this particular day. Let's go ahead and look around.
I love these air plants. I had a real one and they say they're so easy to grow and everything, but I killed mine. So artificial is the way I need to go. <laughs> they had a lot of flowers in and I love artificial florals this time of year. Succulents are really, really pretty. These are nice to go outside on your patio or deck. Um, very, very nice looking items that they had. I was looking for those horse head um, uh, bookends that I saw a few weeks ago, but they were gone and everything out now is for spring. This looks like that travertine stone again. That is like everywhere this, this season. I have not introduced myself in a very long time, but my name is Sandy and I do all things home decor and I love to do shop with me videos where I go into different stores and kind of talk about some of the items that they have in for the season. I specifically enjoy outlet shopping, uh, bargain shopping in general. I'm always looking for a great deal. So if that's something that you enjoy, be sure that you hit that subscribe button before you leave today. I also enjoy purchasing items and decorating my home with them. So if you like home decor, you definitely want to be sure to hit that subscribe button because I have lots of decorating content on my channel as well. And to all of my returning family members, thank you so, so much for stopping back by and coming along shopping with me today. I appreciate each and every one of you. And I hope to see you over here on my next one. Have a great day and enjoy the rest of the video to music. Bye-bye.